Up first uh, in this trio is uh, this belted one that's kind of got a, a funny belt there on the top side of her blade. This is 39-10. Uh, this is one that, uh, that I like a lot. Uh, she's got uh, a very neat mother uh, and a very neat pedigree and, and a neat story as to why she might look this way. Uh, the 39s are sired by Heavy Hitter, uh, obviously a very popular board there at Premium Blend. Uh, Boots and I really felt like that one needed to be uh, implemented here in a few spots, and this was a key sow where we felt like he could really work. Uh, the mother is 1-7. Uh, she would be a mate to uh, Guyer's Reserve Grand at Illinois two summers ago. Uh, she's a JoJo and actually goes back to a, to a very random crossbred sow that we got from Fecky's. That was a, a very, very good generator. And um, just, uh, just a, a very neat young sow and, uh, and one that we've got a lot, of, a lot of confidence in. And I think this guilt, she's got a little different look. Uh, but, uh, you know, her arm's big, her rear leg's big. Uh, when, when she elevates and collects herself and, and does what she's supposed to do uh, from a show pig standpoint, I think this one uh, really looks the part, 39-10. Yeah, I think if you're showing gilts in March, um, I'd pay attention here because I think this one fits, uh, fits the criteria for who you're showing to very, very well. Um, her toes are great up front. Her arm's big. Um, a wild look up front was literally zero throat and zero pull. Um, and then from their back is where she gets really unique to me. She is incredibly short bodied, but long hipped and has an incredible timeless type of a rear leg. Um, Harry on top of that to boot. Uh, man, this thing's got a neat wild look. And uh, whenever they can stretch and pose like that and their arm looks just absolutely, absolutely gigantic, um, it's usually a pretty good start. Um, this thing looks like she can feed um, incredibly well. I love her look. I love her build. Um, I think this thing's got a bright future here.